Good morning guys, this is Parag Kapdi with yet another video on Ecograph. Uh, before, I, before I proceed, can I please request you to pause this video and uh, read this financial disclaimer. This is very very important. Please do that. Okay, so I hope you have read the financial disclaimer and now we can start with the presentation. So, as you know, I've done a few videos on Ecograph in the past and uh, uh, I was avoiding doing this video uh, for the last couple of weeks uh, simply because this is not a conventional analysis that I'm about to show you. Uh, I was, uh, and then I thought, let me, let me just share it with you guys. Uh, how you take it is probably up to you, but uh, there are many people who have requested me to uh, put up my thoughts on any chart. So, and I've used this uh, e EGR in the recent past to show some of some of my analysis. And uh, let's see how this this goes. Yeah. Uh, as the title of this video shows, this is a time study of the ASX listed EGR. So what does time study means? Uh, time study means that uh, we are not going to look, we are not going to concentrate on the price aspect. Yeah. Uh, and I'm just going to concentrate on the time aspect of this. So I do this kind of uh, analysis for the bigger stocks and I, uh, I post them uh, in real time uh, on, on my Twitter. So you can follow it out there. Uh, I avoid doing it for small stocks uh, simply because it's not, uh, these stocks have got their mind of their own, right? One small announcement and a stock, uh, this penny stock like EGR can double or uh, drop by 50%, right? In just matter of few days or even in a single day. So you have to be a bit careful with uh, penny stocks. So please keep that in mind, right? Uh, this is again, this is not any financial advice. Uh, this is a very, very important aspect of uh, analyzing penny stocks. So what, uh, what I do, uh, I use the same analysis on my, I, I post, as I said, I post it on Twitter for large stocks or for the index. Yeah, I do. I post a lot on the index. So the AUS 200 that I trade, uh, those analyses are pretty spot on most of the time, simply because these are very large instruments. Uh, EGR is a very tiny $300 million market cap company. So um, it, it may or it may not work as effectively as it works for my analysis on which I did for FMG a few months ago uh, showing the bottom or things like that right so keep that in mind I, I keep repeating that uh, just so that I don't want people to uh, people to uh, have any false uh, expectations so let's start and uh, what I'm going to do is now I'm going to introduce to you all the elements on this chart. So what am I in? As I said, I'm doing a time analysis. Uh, so let's start introducing the elements out here. Let me move this chart a bit to the left. So first, I've got this trend line. Uh, yeah. So as you can see, there is a blue sloping trend line and a black uh, sloping trend line. Uh, it, the price is now contracting within this two and forming what we call as a, as a wedge. Uh, most of the time, uh, this wedge, uh, uh, wherever it breaks out, so if it breaks out above the blue line, uh, can give you a decent, uh, decent run on the upside. If it, breaks, if it breaks below the bottom line, then it's uh, very bearish. And if it 
if say if the price just keeps uh, trending inside this wedge uh, then what happens is right at the narrow end of this if it breaks out on either side uh, there is not much uh, uh, there is not much that can happen out there. It, it loses its efficiency uh, as it travels inside inside this uh, formation. So breaking out at the right time is most important out here. I'm again concentrating on the time aspect, right? I'm not talking about the price aspect out here. So now, why am I doing this video today on the 3rd of April? Uh, I, I promise that I'll be doing like a couple of weeks ago. I I mess I tweeted that I'm going to do this video, and then I left it. Uh, but today I thought, okay, let me do it because uh, for me the time starts from uh, tomorrow, right? So uh, how did I come on this? I'll I'll, I'll explain it later if this uh, if this whole thing plays out as I expect then I'll probably do another video when it the whole thing is played out as I expect explaining uh, what was I thinking so it will be a, a, a good educational material for those who uh, are, are following me in this uh, TA journey right so I've got two uh, parallel uh, two vertical lines out here representing uh, the 4th of April and the 20th of April so for me right from tomorrow yeah so it does not mean that it, this will happen tomorrow right if if yeah the if is the most important part if the breakout happens between 4th of april and the 20th of april above this blue line or below this black line right above the blue line it's going to be very bullish for me below the black line yeah very bearish right so uh, if if something like this happens uh, any time in the next two weeks remember this month has got a lot lot of holidays right so uh, with these holidays this time analysis can go uh, can go wrong by a couple of days yeah so just be a bit tolerant yeah don't don't stick to this 20th april but in in the perfect world if this were to happen between 4th and the 20th of April, yeah, uh, on either side, right? So we'll I'll concentrate on the bullish aspect uh, first. So if that happens, then what I expect is that this uh, breakout should run all the way between. Uh, sorry between 19th of july to the 25th of august so as i said a, uh, egr has had a few runs but they as you can see they're like very narrow kind of a, like a spike and then it flops down again spikes up and then flops down but if this were to happen between 4th and the 20th of april i expect this run to go all the way up to july or august again i'm not talking about what price it can be whether it's going to double i'm not uh, too fussed about the price aspect out here yeah so so for this bull for this bull case yeah what what do i need then the breakout has to happen in this duration right as i said if if it travels within this wedge yeah a, the more it travels inside the wedge it will be a lesser effective uh, breakout right and same for the for the bear case scenario below this black line uh, it's bearish and uh, if it breaks down then same thing it can keep going down all the way up to 25th of august and uh, what i've observed that the more the price travels within this wedge any breakout on the upper side uh, is of lesser intensity uh, compared to any breakout on the lower side so the bear case wins in this uh, in this uh, journey so hopefully 
uh, because as you know uh, i i am a long time long term holder of uh, egr so i am not buying it just because i am bullish today i already bought so for me if it plays out it's good if it does not play out uh, i am not putting any money today so i hope nobody does this nobody uh, puts any money based on this video as i said this is not a financial advice yeah please please uh, get yourself some uh, proper financial advices uh, and and this as i said this bull run can can last all the way up to 25th of uh, 25th of august and there's another there's another uh, date coming up but it's too far off uh, in december so i'll i'll not talk about this date uh, as of now yeah so we'll just stick with uh, we'll just stick with uh, the near term target so um, and uh, yeah so let's see how this goes uh, the only reason i am doing this video as i said is because this date is tomorrow and i thought let me just put it out there uh, i avoid uh, putting uh, such an analysis for penny stocks uh, i do it mostly for the larger one so hope uh, hope this uh, video if if everything works out if everything works out as as i wish i wanted to yeah then probably i'll do a proper video on how did i come up with this date so these are not just dates which i'm just putting it uh, uh, just because i want this to break out today or tomorrow or something like that there is a bit of analysis on, on these dates uh, let it work out if it works out i'll show you so if you've been watching this video for uh, until now uh thanks a lot for uh, your time and uh, let's see how this plays out yeah so as usual please uh, post your comments uh, i i always try to reply uh, to the best of my abilities i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, yeah let's see what does egr do <laughs>